Today's episode was a request by Animal Crossing Yes Resetti no AUTTPAVGCP. She sent her request through our request form. It's called, The Troublemakers Cause Mayhem at the Mario Movie Premiere, Grounded. Harold, are you sure you want me to start on dinner early? Absolutely honey. The kids told us that they have a half day today, so I don't see why not. Alright, I'll go ahead and get started. Do chili dogs sound good to you? Oh heck yeah. Chili dogs are amazing. The kids will love it too. Okay, I'll start in a little bit. Hey mom, we're home. Welcome home kids. How was school? It was great. And guess what? Principal Wyatt is going to be hosting a field trip tomorrow to the premiere of the Super Mario Brothers movie, and he invited the whole school. Now, that sounds like a lot of fun. Is everyone in the school going? Yeah. All of us get to go. We just need our permission slip signed by you guys. Sounds good. Kick and Brianna, I can sign the both of yours. And I'll gladly sign your permission slip too, Brad. If you promise to me that you'll be on your best behavior at the movies tomorrow. Chill out, Dad. I won't misbehave this time. Unlike Sonic, Mario's games are well made, even though I hate Mario himself. I have no reason to misbehave. We'll see about that, Brad. Hand your permission slip over and I'll sign it. There you go, son. It's signed. Have fun at the movies tomorrow. This is going to be the best movie premiere ever. Meanwhile. Alright Sky, I finished signing your permission slip. You can go and see the movie tomorrow, but I do not want to hear that you were harassing the boyfriend again. I don't know how many times I have to tell you to leave him alone Sky. No fair dad, I want to sit next to keep at the movie. You can't make me not see him. Yes I can. I am your father, and what I say goes. The boyfriend loves the girlfriend, not you Sky. I feel like a broken record trying to tell you this, but if I so much hear that you've been harassing the boyfriend tomorrow, you will be grounded until another Mario movie comes out. Now you better behave yourself. Well you know what, I'm going to see Keith anyway, I don't care about what my dad said. You know, I think it'll also be fun if I cause some mayhem at the movie as well. I should call up Santa and Craig to see if they want in. Sanjay, are you gonna get that? Oh yeah, right. Hello. Hi Sanjay, are you and Craig there? Yeah, we're both here. What's up Sky? Are you two going to the premiere of the Super Mario Brothers movie tomorrow? Oh definitely. We just got our permission slips signed by my parents. Is she asking about the movie tomorrow Sanjay? A plan you say. I'm listening. Yeah. Uh -huh. Oh wow. Sanjay, what are you and Sky planning? We gotta tell the rest of our friends about our plan. I'll call them. Alright, see ya tomorrow. Later. What are we going to do with Sky? Sky told me that she is going to cause mayhem at the movie theater tomorrow and she'll be trying to get the boyfriend to kiss her. I like that idea so we're gonna call classic Caillou, Dora, Sapai, and Brad to see if they want in. You already know I want in. I'll go ahead and call up the rest of the troublemakers. This is a plan I can get behind. Let's go cause some mayhem at the Mario movie premiere, and maybe, just maybe, I'll make the girlfriend mine and only mine. Later, Chilis. Okay, is this everybody? Yep, yeah, it should be. So, what kind of mayhem are we going to cause at the premiere tomorrow? Personally, I was thinking of playing rock music while eating snacks from behind a concession stand. I am going to run around the theater while yelling and making a mess. I am going to be the movie and throw tomatoes at the screen. I will find the boyfriend and give him lots of hugs and kisses. 
Craig and I will break into the projector room and rip all the whole theater. Yeah? Everyone knows that getting Rick rolled is the ultimate form of embarrassment. I'll do the same thing as Sky, except with the girlfriend. Well then it's settled. We all know what we want to do at the movies tomorrow. This is gonna be so awesome. Hey look, it's the soldier. And he works at Chili's. Not you backstabbing hippies again! You will not stab me in the back and take my weapon again! That is an order! Oh yeah? And what exactly are you going to do about it? You're just a dumb guy in a military uniform who isn't even a real soldier. I'll kick you all out! That's what I'll do! I've been promoted to manager since the last time I saw you maggots! Now get out of my sight or I'll start cracking some necks! Back! Ugh! Okay! Fine, we're leaving! Nice going, Brand. You got us all kicked out of Chili's. Don't act so innocent, guys. I saw your faces back there. You were egging me on. Touche. We still don't have a place to meet. We are banned from this Chili's location, and that means we'll have to go to a different one. That's true, but Chili's isn't the main focus right now. Let's just go home and get ready for the movie tomorrow. The next day. Alright, kids, it's time to go to the theater. Are you all ready to go? You bet mom and dad. This is gonna be the best movie premiere ever. Okay, let's get in the car. We'll drop you kids off at the theater. Hello Beavis and Butthead, it's great to see you both. You got your permission slips? Uh, here are those custom things you wanted, sir. <laughs> Excellent. You guys can go in, the theater the movie will be playing at is Theater 10. You can sit anywhere you want. Enjoy the movie guys. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Good evening. Do the two of you have your permission slip so you can see the movie? We got them right here. Can we go inside? Absolutely. You'll be going to Theater 10, enjoy the film Spongebob, you too Patrick. Greetings Kick and Brianna. And Brad too I guess. Do you all have your permission slips? You bet we do. We wouldn't miss this movie for the world. Great to hear. The movie is playing in Theater 10. You can get popcorn and snacks before the movie starts. I hope you guys have fun. And Brad, you better behave. Yeah Brad, you better listen. Shut up. That kid is up to something again. We'll just have to wait and see what it is. Um, excuse me. Aren't you going to see our permission slips? Oh, right. My apologies Flutter Girl and Princess Matilda. I'll check your permission slips and then you can go in. Okay Dillweeds, you can go ahead to the theater. I'll get the popcorn and stuff. Whatever that. Just don't get a small popcorn bag for yourself. Now that Kick and Brianna are out of the way, let's go meet up with my friends. Hey Brad, are you ready to start causing havoc? Yeah. But I think we should wait until the movie is about to start. Let's wait around for about five minutes. Good thinking. As fun as it would be to start now. I think we should wait until more people come so our mayhem will be more effective. Hey Mario and Peach. I just wanted to congratulate you guys on your debut. This movie is going to be amazing. Thank you very much! We're very excited for you all to see the film. We worked extremely hard on it for the past few years. I can already tell it's something special. The movie looks so good from the footage we've seen from the trailers. We are glad you think so. The previews will start playing in a moment, so feel free to sit down. Okay. I'll go find a seat. Well, Mario, this is it. It's the premiere of possibly one of our biggest moments of our lives. Guys, the previews are about to start. Now's our chance. You heard classic Kylo, guys. Let's go cause some mayhem. And like, two extra bins of popcorn for Scoob and I. Okay, is it all for you guys? As a matter of fact, yes. Now I will take over the concession stand. Hey, Brand, you're not allowed back here. Get out of here, you stupid idiot. <laughs> Toings, let's like get out of here, man. Forget the movie. I don't want us to get hurt by some psycho kid. Yes. I finally have the concession stand all to myself. Time to eat every single thing here. He's down 
gonna get all the garlic seasoning. We gotta tell Mario how about this. That's our job! This must be the projector room. Let's go inside. Weird. There's nobody in here. No matter. Let's change the movie into Never Gonna Give You Up. It'll be so funny, and the moviegoers will not see it coming. And now, our feature presentation. Please remember to silence your cell phones at this time, and locate the exit signs in the theater in case of an emergency. Enjoy this special premiere of the Super Mario Brothers movie. Boo. Boo you. This movie sucks. Play something better. Boo you. Hey, this isn't the Mario movie. We've been recrolled. Where's the movie? I don't want to watch this crap. Yeah, we came here for the Mario movie, not to get trick rolled. Oh no, something's wrong. They're booing the movie. I knew it. They hate the movie. I guess this means this wasn't a success after all. You know, the movie just started. It isn't normal for them to boo this early. Something must be wrong with the projector. You're right, Mario. I think we should go check on everything. There you are. We got an emergency. What are you two knuckleheads doing here? Oh, you are in planning on ruining the premiere. Some kid is eating all the food at the concession stand. You got to stop him. That's terrible. All right. There's clearly a lot of stuff going on at once. We should split up, Mario and I will check the theater, Peach and Toad will check the projector room, the Wario brothers will go back to the concession stand, and Luigi will. We e e e e e e e e e Take this stupid principle. Hi 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 we e e e e e e Luigi. Get. That. Little. Brat. Oh dear. Are you okay? I'll be fine. Just go do your tasks guys. Ah, uh, that was good. I think just one more bite would be good. There he is! Oh no. I can't move. I've gotten too fat. Alright, Matto. Let's take you to the principal. You are in big trouble. No, 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 no. Let go of me. No wonder why everyone is so upset. The movie isn't even playing. They got Rick Roll. We got to call the audience down before things get the nasty. Alright, that's enough. Everybody calm down. The projector is experiencing some issues, and the movie will play very shortly. There's no need to get this crazy. But KBAMF 2006, Dora started booing the movie first. Well, if that's the case. Dora, you are coming with us. Wait outside of the theater doors. And don't think I didn't notice you two troublemakers up there. Let the boyfriend and the girlfriend go and leave the theater. Go wait with Dora. Oh my god dude, thank you so much. As for the rest of you, please don't cause a ruckus like that again. The movie will be playing after we figure out what's wrong with the projector. Sorry KBAMF 2006. It won't happen again. We were just upset that we got Rick rolled. No worries Natalie. Just make sure that you guys don't boo the movie again. Five minutes later. Well, I can't say that I was shocked that you seven would cause trouble yet again. But seriously? Eating all the food at the concession stand, tampering with the projector, booing the movie, harassing your crushes again, and hitting me in the groin? This is a new low for even you troublemakers. You better believe this is worth a decade suspension. We'll be calling your parents as well. Not only did you cause mayhem at the theater, but you did a lot of damage that has to be paid for. You seven did hundreds of dollars in damages. Your parents will be paying the damage costs. You almost ruined the premiere, but thankfully we managed to fix your screw-ups. Nice day you are, KB. F2006 was all of your parents. Hello parents. This is Principal Wyatt, also known as KBAMF 2006. 
I am forwarding this message to all of you because your children caused havoc at the Mario movie premiere. Brad ate all the concession stand food, Sanjay and Craig messed with the projector, Dora jeered the movie and threw tomatoes, Sky and Senpai were harassing the boyfriend and girlfriend, and classic Kalo ran around the theater being loud and annoying, and he punched me in the coconuts. I expect all these troublemakers to be punished when they get home. Thank you, alright, all of you go home. I sent a message to all of your parents. Now scram. Alright, with those troublemakers gone, I think the movie premiere should go a lot more smoothly. I agree. Toad and I already changed the projector back to the film, and the audience sounded really happy. What are we standing around for? We should go inside and join the audience for the premiere. I couldn't agree more. Let's go enjoy the movie. When the troublemakers got home. Brad. How dare you cause mayhem at the Mario movie premiere with your troublemaker friends? And we can't believe you got fat from eating all those concession stamp snacks. You are grounded 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 until another Mario film comes out. Now go to your room and start losing all that weight you gained. Why I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I Classic Kalu. How dare you cause mayhem at the Mario movie premiere with your friends? And how dare you hit your principal in the crotch? That was totally uncalled for. You are grounded 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 until another Mario movie releases. Quit throwing a temper tantrum and go to your room now. Dora. We can't believe you caused mayhem at the Mario movie premiere with your troublemaker friends. How dare you boo the movie as well? That's extremely rude and disruptive to the rest of the people at the movie theater. You are grounded, grounded, grounded until another Mario movie gets made. Go upstairs to your room now. What? Uh -huh. Sanjay and Craig, how dare you both cause mayhem at the Mario movie premiere? And we can't believe you changed the projector to rip roll the entire theater. You are grounded, 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 grounded until a sequel to the Mario movie gets made. Go to your room right now. Sky, how dare you cause mayhem at the Mario movie with your friends? I literally told you to leave the boyfriend alone, but you didn't listen. When will you learn that he hates you? That's it. You are grounded, 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 grounded until another new Mario movie is released. Now go upstairs to your room now. Senpai, we are very disappointed in you. How dare you cause mayhem at the Mario movie premiere with your friends? We give you everything you could possibly want. Money, good schools, even popularity. But you still choose to go after a woman who isn't even interested in you. You are grounded 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 until a new Mario film gets made. You'll have your weekly allowance of $100,000 cut in half as well. No dad, please. Anything but my allowance. Too bad. Now go to your room right now. Wow. 